Good morning! So me and Vic have been up since 4 a.m. We went gog fishing this morning at a secret location, I can't tell you. We just got a pub sub and our gogs are right here. We're doing nice and good. We went for a road trip. We actually are on the way to fish with Darcizzle and her boyfriend Brian. So stay tuned and we're going to have a fun day fishing offshore. Yeah, we're on. Yeah, you yeah. <laughs> You see any color yet? Nope. Yeah, I see color now. You alright? Got it? Yeah. Oh man, you got a button. No, that might be It's an AJ. Not a bad size one. Nice. We don't need that. I'll just grab it. Right here. First fish of the day. Woo! -hoo. There's the first agent. Oh. No gap Woo. needed. We got him. Reef doggy in the boat. Big wave coming. Oh, yeah. You're oh, on. Oh, oh, oh. Come on. What is he doing? No, you're, I think you're on. You're on. Yeah, you're on. You're on. You're on. Keep going. Oh, oh. Go, 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 go. Logan, Logan, Logan. Oh! That's a big one. That's a bigger one, Darcy. Um, Ryan, watch the engine. Turn the engine that way. Is it? Here he comes. Yep. Nice, AJ. We're at the weight. Yes. Right there. That's an Alamico. Those okay. are actually good to eat. Alamicos don't have a limit or size regulation, so we're gonna keep this one and kill it for food because they actually taste really good. Oh, 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 oh Brick's on! Brick's on! Get him, babe! Oh, oh we got him. Nice job. That tip is shaking violently. Yes. I love it. Nice job. Ooh, he's close to him. 28 to the fork? No, he's 27. 23. Okay, no, baby. he's 27. All right, so I had three attempts. I finally got a fish to the boat. This is a greater amberjack, you can tell, because his top fin isn't as tall as the Amakos. We've caught two Amakos, and this is the second greater amberjack. They have to be 28 inches to the fork. This one's 27, so we gotta let him go. We gotta let this guy go to grow a little bigger. There he goes. Woo! Good job, babe. Yay. Yeah. Woo! Come on, get up, get up, get up. Crank, big crank, 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 crank. Go, go, go. Yeah. Go, 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 go. Oh my god! Oh, it's a grouper! Oh, oh, oh it's god. a giant black grouper! Oh, grab it, grab it, grab it! Pricker! Slow down, slow down, get the pricker. Pricker, pricker. Slow down. Holy god! Oh, oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Is no it is it season? Way. Is no. it season? No! It's oh my god! Oh, Victor! It's a giant black grouper, oh. but it's out of season! <laughs> Oh this man! Is insane right now. This Ooh. is like a 20 pound black grouper. Nice. Holy shit. I can't believe it. It is not season. Grouper's closed right now, but that is every bit of 20, 25 pound black grouper. Incredible. A beautiful fish on a live dog. It is so sad it is not season. We gotta let this guy go. Grouper season is closed, but that is a monster. And very happy we caught him. And he went straight back down. Didn't need the venting tool at all. He swam straight down. Awesome work, guys. Nice job. So sick. <laughs> we had a great day offshore fishing today. We caught three amber jacks on the wreck and two amico jacks. We're actually gonna, I'm actually gonna do a catch and cook with one of the amico jacks. They're actually really good eating. And Victor caught a giant black grouper today, so. Out of season, though. I know you guys would probably like to see that for a catch and cook instead of amico jacks, but amico jacks are actually really good to eat. And yeah. 
You can't forget the grouper. That was incredible. It's we'll come fun. back in May and we'll get them. And yeah. then we'll do a catch and cook with the grouper. We'll get them. <laughs> Don't worry. <laughs>
looking good. So this is a perfect fish to do this recipe with because the fish is extremely firm. If you did this with something like yellowtail, yellowtail is extremely flaky, so it's gonna be a little bit harder to work with. So I had my fish that's fried on this pan. I'm gonna put on some Parmesan cheese on top. I'm gonna put it in the oven and let the cheese melt. Four minutes to cook, so I'm gonna put those in now. So my fish have been in for about five minutes to let the cheese melt. So I have a little bit of butter in the pasta, and I'm gonna add a little bit of garlic salt for flavor. Garnishing with tomatoes and scallions. Now for the last and most important part, the sauce. Alrighty, so there's the final product. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching. And don't forget to like and also to subscribe. Thanks.